Trade. Uh, time banks are basically a service exchange network. So you create a network of people who each offer different services, and for every hour of work you do for someone in the time bank, you earn one time credit. If I were to go and babysit for your kids for an hour, I would earn one time credit, and I could then spend that time credit on have my driveway shoveled, or I could have an acupuncture appointment. One hour is equal to one time credit, and it's the same no matter what the services are. Hi, this is Jessica. She's come here to use our computers. We are very close to downtown at 15 Grove Street and our office is open every morning. Members come in and use their computers. She can check the newest service offers and requests. Oh wow, riding to and from Boston. I need to go to Boston sometimes. That would be cool. Ever since we've had someone working full-time on this, uh, there have been a lot of new members and a lot of people making exchanges, so it's really exciting to see. What's your name? Sage. And what did you get? I got uh, apple pie for the Thanksgiving holiday. Wow! What do you give, Sage? Um, every other week, I, another Time Trade member comes by and we, we sketch. I give drawing lessons. My name's Laura. What are you getting? I'm going to use Abby's kayak this afternoon. Hey, Abby. Hey, Laura. Beautiful day for kayaking. It is. Thank you so much. My name's Abby. And what do you get? I get somebody to come over in the middle of the day and walk my dog, Scarlett. I'm Lynn. And what do you get? I'm going to be getting drawing lessons, learning how to draw dogs. Uh, my name is Emma Hallowell. Let's see, I'm connected to the time trade. Um, I'm one of the founding members. Got really interested in time banking and saw a lot of the positive benefits. So a classmate of, my, of mine and I decided to start a time bank in Brattleboro. My name is Megan. And what did you get? Mm, I got an amazing Thai massage. So I had a custom carrying case made for my massage mat. Yeah! I am assisting Steve in building this strong, beautiful rock wall. Yeah. A little down slope. Yeah, my name is Steve Crofter. One of our uh, time trade members needed to get his 89-year-old dad to a uh, eye doctor appointment, and uh, he's not able to do it because he's at work. And so I'm going to go get him now. And all of a sudden, it feels like things are really taking off because we've hired a director. Hi, my name is Laura Brooks. I came to Brattleboro three months ago specifically to be the coordinator of the time trade through their VISTA position. Mm -hmm. Laura Brooks started in July and we have office space downtown that we are exchanging time credits for. Well, my name is Bob Ozer. Well, I've done a number of things. I helped tear down a porch, helped uh, winterize a house, and helped clean the windows at the time trade office this year. So one of the main reasons why I wanted to start a time bank is um, not just because you can get services from people outside of the cash economy, that's, that's great, but the real benefit that I see and that I think a lot of people see is the community building and meeting people who you would never meet otherwise. I'm having someone come and help me with my windows right now, and I've never met him before. He just moved to town, and this is a great way to you know, strengthen, strengthen the bonds of the community. My name is Randy Bright. Uh, time trades, mostly I give uh, weatherization advice and consultation, uh, help people to learn to uh, modify their houses and their habits in order to save energy. I'm mostly banking my hours, so just kind of trading it up and saving it, uh, yeah, saving it for a rainy day, I guess. I moved to this area about three years ago, and, and this whole process has certainly made me feel a lot more connected. Well, I got my bike fixed, I got a tune-up from Dan Ridgeway. 
today I was just doing a bicycle tune-up for Bob Ozer. I've gotten some amazing garden work. I'm going to get some help in a wood shop building some furniture for my apartment. I might actually email someone later tonight about getting a haircut. One thing that's really fascinating is the way folks are getting to know their neighbors in a new way. Uh, it really allows people to connect on a new level. Edgar Kahn, the father of time banking, calls it creating neighborhood memory. We're using the computer to create connections with people that may not connect otherwise. But this creates an opportunity for folks to interact with people they may not normally come in contact with. And it really creates a wonderful network of community support. I'm Suzanne Weinberg. I joined Time Trades uh, because I was interested in doing more of the work I love and less of the work that I feel like is a burden. My name is Allison Wendt. Because uh, I have more time than money. I, I love the idea of uh, people being able to share their skills and not have to necessarily spend money. I thought A, it was a great way to meet people in the community. I love the idea of trading services. I joined it because we were, I found that we were doing trades naturally with our friends and when we heard about this it made a lot of sense. Well I joined time trade because I don't believe in the in the typical economic model where we trade our uh, our life's energies for dollars so that it's trading energies and also it's a fabulous way to meet more members of the community. I mean it's great to uh, be more involved and, and know people on a real level.